Welcome back to my channel. And it's literally morning. I've been seeing videos about glass skin. For the most part, it is for like 20 and 30, 20 year olds, 20, 20 something year olds. I've, I haven't seen any for 30 year olds. So I decided to put one together for us over 40. Yes, it's over 40. And over 45. Yes, I'm technically over 45 now. So I decided to put one together. Because y'all see, this is, well, that's makeup. But y'all see my skin. This is before washing and cleansing my face. So welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey, hun. My name is Kimberly, Kimberly Shantae. Y'all remember back in the day, Roxanne Shantae? Yeah, that's Shantae. My name is Kimberly Shantae. And I just wanted to do a video for us over 40 to show how we get glass skin. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is my skin before. I want to make sure I give y'all the before look. I'm going to show you all the products I'm using. Just so you're aware. So, um, I want to start off with this product. And this is just a face wash that I purchased at um, Marshall's. Let me make sure. No, Ross. I purchased this at Ross. And I just like face wash that bubbles up, that suds up. I, I've tried the ones that don't. But I really like the ones that do. So this is what that is. So I'm going to start with this because I want to do some like dermal cleaning to kind of get rid of some of the fuzz on my on my skin. I mean on my face. Get rid of some of the fuzz on my face as well as y'all. I have little hair down here. I want to pluck and get rid of. So I'm going to start with that. I'm going to cleanse my face and then I'll do some dermal cleaning. So this is my first step in my skincare routine. So if you're interested in seeing how um, people over 40 keep their skin snatched and have glass skin, as they call it now, um, stick around. bacteria and different things I was like you know what let me just get start using the face cloths so I actually use them and I'm gonna buy some more when I run out off of Amazon but yeah these aren't the best quality but I purchased them so I'm using them because we over here we don't waste money I'm getting into that as they say getting into my bag I'm trying to keep what I have in my bag so, I've been trying to do really good about that. But yeah, if you follow me on my hauls and you see my hauls and stuff, this is one of the items I purchased from Timo. It's not the best quality, like I said, but it is what it is. So, I still use them. And I got two out because I just dried off. So, now I want to use this product, which I got this from, I believe... Marshalls, and this is a um, aloe vera gel that my daughter put me on to. Yeah, and I actually like it, but I like it to use it for my dermal planning instead of oil. I use this aloe vera gel, and it works really good for me. So I want to clean up a little bit. Yeah, 
So I bought these razors from Target. And that's what I'm going to use to do some dermal planning. I'm not a professional. I don't know what I'm doing. It's my face. So I just, I tried it and I like that. I noticed that whenever I did wear makeup, it kind of went on smoother. So I actually like it and I didn't see all that fuzzy stuff on my face, which is hair. So I'm going to just do a little bit. I'm not going majorly. So I normally start by putting this all over my face. Y'all know, us women that suffer with hair down here, it could be annoying, but this is what I found that I kind of like. I'm going to say kind of because I really do want to do um, uh, laser hair treatment, but I just don't want to do it yet. But yeah, this is the razor. Let me get it closer. I got to pay attention, honey, because this is my face. Just a little bit, nothing major. hair so that's the major part I really want to get done so yeah that's what I do then now my next step you know I already washed my face but I need to rewash it because I just did that to get rid of the hair that I just escaped <laughs> landscaped but yeah I love my Fenty I'm almost out of this y'all look at that but I love my Fenty so I go in and rewash my face again with Fenty. And this is the Fenty Total Cleanser. So, you know, I do not um, dermaplane my face. Um, nothing but maybe once a month. I never do it a lot. And I haven't done it in a while. And I'm preparing for a vacation again. So, I was like, why not just cleanse my face, get it prepped for vacation. So, I've done that. And I have this. Bath and Body Works lip exfoliation. So I want y'all see these crusty lips. I need to get out of the habit of biting my lip. It's a nervous tick I have that I just bite my lips. That's why I look pink and clear. But anywho, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. <laughs> Look good. I'm a, this is a 
this is a nighttime mask, but who really use stuff only in the, at nighttime when it says it? It says Lip Sleeping Mask by Laneige, Laneige. I got this from Marshalls, so I'm going to use this on my lips. Speed it up. Speed it up. Trying to clean up as I do this stuff, y'all, because put stuff back where it was. So we done all this, we done the scaping of my face. So the next step is uh the Fenty toner. So I only use this in the summer months because my skin is a little more on the little more on the oily side, but in the summertime, or in the wintertime. My skin is on the dry side, so I normally stick with using this as my toner, the ordinary. But I'm gonna use this today on my face. Have this cotton pad, so I'm gonna go ahead and get this going. So we're gonna go here and here. Let's see what you really feel. I could have done it with my hands. I'm just doing it with this just because normally I do it with my hands. Depends on what crazy thought will cross my brain and I just do it with a and drag it on down to your neck. Yeah, don't forget your neck. You want to make sure your neck stay tight and right as you age gracefully. Graceful, gracefully. You want to make sure you age and gracefully over there. So, don't forget your neck and your chest area. And I did go down and wash that part. So, yeah, there's that. So next, I want to increase my hydration. Y'all, this was a game changer for me. I started using this. I purchased it, I purchased this during the VIB sale. Y'all, you don't listen to nothing else I got to say during this video. Get this. Look at my skin. It's looking good. Look at it now. And how hydrated my skin got. Do y'all not see that just change within a few seconds? Wow. Completely hydrated now. Don't forget your neck. This stuff is too cool. This belief. This is the one I got. The belief, the true cream. It is this good. It is the truth. Y'all. Look at my skin. Is it pretty? Mm-hmm. Alright. Let me 
still track. So for y'all know, I look puffy under my eyes. So I'm gonna go ahead and use the ordinary um, caffeine solution, five percent. Let me put it in there. Do it work? I don't know. But I like to make sure I have something under my eyes. So I'm all I'm alternating between L'Oreal. alternate between L'Oreal, the eye cream, and caffeine. Um, yeah, I have a lot of stuff for my eyes. So, this is my eye cream. And I use my index finger because it's supposed to be the most gentle one. My index finger. So I even drag it all the way to the top. So there's that. And then, y'all know, I rave about the ordinary product. I still love them. So I'm going to put the nacinamide and the hyaluronic acid. On this, still love them, still using them. Speed it up, speed it up, speed it up, speed it up. Hold on, hold on, speed it up, hold on, hold on, speed it up, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, speed it up, hold on, speed it up, speed it up, sky. wash from Ross, but if I can find it, I'll link it. So yeah, this is my ordinary product. I feel like that belief elevated my glass skin routine. And the last step, don't forget, honeys, uh, this is Fenty SPF. I like this one because it still gives me my shine. The Super Goop, the one that I purchased, is more for me. I feel like it's better used under your makeup because it's like a primer. But I really like Fenty because of the shine. So I like the dewy look. Oh, wow, that looks really good. What do y'all think, y'all? Before I put that on. And I'm not wet. It's not wet at all. At all. So, this is... And I'm using my travel size because I'm out of my big one, but... following me on my journey I love to take care of my skin so that I don't need makeup but I like makeup here and there so this is my day-to-day -day, everyday face routine excluding the dermaplaning 
excluding the dermaplaning. But this is my day-to-day -day face routine. This is how I get that over 40 glass skin. I just want to represent for us. I want to represent for us. So what do you think? Is it too much? Um, the process is too long. But I felt like it was simple. The only thing that costs um, relatively high is my Fenty product as well as the Belief. Everything else was affordable. So, yeah, I have it all linked in the description window. But, yeah, tell me what y'all think. So, y'all, that is the end of my skincare routine. Um, how I get glass, the glass skin. Tell me what you think. I'm getting up close so you can see. I like it. It's shiny. It's cute. So, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.